Welcome back to Tran Plays Zedzo. Day 3. We have not sorted out any of this stuff in the uh, warehouse. All the zombie corpses that we defeated last time have reassembled themselves, wasting my, my precious dagger points. We really need to sort this out at some point, but now is not that time. To charge your air rifle, you need to hold R, and then a pop-up will appear on the bottom right, which you must then go and click. And then without doing anything else, you must then tap R a lot of times. If you do something else, it'll cancel your charging. I kind of figured if I went for a chest shot, he would die because I hit him with a headshot earlier, but... He, he got scared. He saw what happened to his brother and was like, I don't want any of that. What was that? Copper dagger. Okay, rope stacks, thankfully. I was gonna assume it didn't because there was no number next to the rope when it was just singular. Apparently the rat's just walking on the wall and trying to close this door, but it wanted me to inspect the dead body. Room looks fine. Chuck some stuff down. To repair what would I need? Didn't that used to say before the patch? I think I think it used to say what you would need to Okay, repairable for this is wood and rope. Repairable for I guess I can't repair that. And I can't repair that. I guess that makes sense as a cheap dagger that I just made. Wrist breaker. Fires a 12 gauge shot. Okay. And it probably may have ammo in it, but again, we're gonna sort that out in a minute. This is a small melee weapon that I made. We'll go and take that instead because it's much tinier. CTR stock. All right. So I need my lumber back. Actually, I should probably grab the meat too as well. Mm, water? Maybe I should grab water. So what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to make a campfire and I'm morbidly curious. Can I do it in the building and will it be safe at all? <laughs> I mean, in, in real life, I would obviously never do this, but this is a video game and I'm, I am curious what will happen. All right, I think I got all the, no, I should have more meat than that because I killed at least two deer. Here we go.
All right. Um. my character is breathing. I don't like it. I'm assuming it's the mask. I only put it on because I wanted to save four, four inventory slots. Build. I can do a cooking hob. Place on bonfire. Which requires a cooking pot, an iron tube, or just some campfire. Let's see if we have a cooking pot somewhere, but I don't, I don't think so. Not seeing anything like that. All right, no cooking pot. Got a bunch of money. Okay, I guess we are. Well, I need some stone then. All right, which one of you guys have stone? I got to see a bottle there, but I'm not going back out in the rain for that. That is iron ore, two rock. That might be all the rock I have. Oh, here's another one. Wait, that's iron ore. Okay, let's go ahead and pick this up in case it's useful for this fire at all. All right, let's continue to try to assemble this hastily put together fire uh, right here in the open area. Fuel management. Okay. I guess it uses the wood that I put into it. And can I make this? No, it says combustible for this, but not for plant fiber. All right. Well, let's let's try igniting this. Use an item with the ignition property to start a fire. If you don't have one, you can make a simple fire tool using sticks and bark. Uh, I guess I I don't have one. Sticks and bark. Lint. Okay, that's not it. Fire torch. Uh, that's not it either. Log fire tool. Okay, so we... Uh, Alright. Let's go get a bark. Bark, bark. Come on. <laughs> it's just lagging so much running around the... Trying to run around the... Um, searching that body. Oh, come on. <sighs> Alright, so what I think is good. I think the game needs me to actually destroy the tree for the bark, which, of course, you shouldn't have to. Like, that's the whole point of this fire, is that I, I have a nice small piece of bark that I can use to help set it, right? It's flexible, it's easy to tear off. Oh, there we go, there's some bark. That's what I needed. <laughs> I like how my um <laughs> I like how my wooden stick hitting a tree sounds sounds exactly like a real life. <laughs> wow. Okay, let's try this again. Craft log fire tool. Uh, bark. Stick. Make me click so many times for this. Okay. Let's ignite without standing in it. Barbecue. So do I need to hit F when it's ready? Because I have no idea when... Okay, looks like it's well cooked, he says. At least I can manage my inventory, I think. Nope, nope. When I go out of inventory, it's uh, no longer there. Well, I've got to stand here and do this. And maybe if I had a cooking pot, I wouldn't have to. But what I really want is try to boil my water. But maybe I need a cooking pot to do that. 
I don't want to drink it. I want to cook it. All right. So this is not going to work. I'm going to need to find a cooking pot. I'm not squeamish about the bodies, but I would like them out of here. Especially if, it's, if I'm trying to open my door and I keep searching the body instead. Okay, well, we'll put the food right here. Go and eat one. Use. I guess it just slowly increases over time. Okay. How much does it tell me how much it gives me? 30. We'll probably want a second one. Food there. Even though it's not really something I want to drink, I'll just put drinks here. After we return home from this trip, we'll start sorting out inventory. So if there's a day skip here or there, uh, that's just because it took me that long to sort my warehouse. I don't like that these guys notice me before I do. I understand I was running. But I, I, I get the impression that he would have figured out it was there even without me running. Low fever. Severe pain. Fever. Sharp pain. What day is it? What am I writing? Hungry, hungry, itchy, tasty. Can I hit him through this fence? Probably not. Okay. Okay, what's that two we're, we're added to my inventory? Dude is fast. I don't know if it's a product of nighttime or what. I don't know why he's saying he can't run. Jeez. Okay. He's not running anymore. Maybe I should shoot them in the leg more often like that. Yeah, let's check out those cars. I'm kind of hoping that one of them sets up a car alarm so that it will drag on any zombies I miss and I can do some other stuff in the meantime.
I don't. Apparently, I'm using my cast aiming assist. That's I guess that's like vats. All right. Exit. I, I wanted to inspect vehicle. Oh, that's that's not a V. It's low battery. I don't know why this is gray, but this is green. Do these things have? Oh, hold on. It's under Q. No, get away. These cars are mine. I found them first. Oh, come on. Stupid traffic cone. Impenetrable to all but the greatest weapons. Oh, can I just hit this? Oh, okay. Alright, let's search this vehicle. We have a Kevlar suit head. 80% defense to 20% thermal. Does slow me down a little, but we'll go ahead and take it with us for now. 1088. Repair with weapon parts. Okay. But I can't salvage. I can't just like take pieces from it, I assume. Kevlar suit head. Just grab these for now. Thanks for uh, making it easier for me to get scrap metal. Did you just hit me, dude? Seriously. <laughs> you bit me through the fence. That is stupid. I don't want to close the door on them because I still want to loot the area. I need to actually deal with them. Man, I might as well be throwing bad words at him. There's at least one more in here. Maybe I got bored. Yeah, this has a lot of space. Um... Engine is 1%. Okay, I can tab out. That's good. This is very badly damaged. Um, search. Okay, it has even more space. 
I like that that I can see. Okay, hold on. So it says part durability 100%, but I see that there's no tire here, so that's what that means. That's why it's a gray. Like, that, I could have assumed that it was missing or something, but it, I was misled by the fact the game actually tells me it's at 100%. I'm sorry, that is not at 100%. <laughs> Alright, so we, we need to figure out how to... Oh, I can actually remove battery. Okay, hold on. Okay. Well, let's... Try chucking a bunch of stuff in here for now, so that maybe we can start working on car parts. Because, you know, four hats is about the same size as an engine, I bet. Wrong button. Okay, remove battery. Okay, no, I'm sorry. Four hats is bigger than a vehicle battery. Bunch of stuff. Oh wow, I can remove a lot. I just can't do anything with the the uh, the engine. I can extract fuel. Do I have any container for that? Do I need a container for that? Or is the game just automatically do so? I don't want to mess it up. Uh, I guess we'll just find out. Let's extract extract one fuel and see what happens. No container. Okay. Okay, we're gonna shove everything into this vehicle. I thought it's tell me there yeah, it does tell me durability here. You know, I must be incredibly strong because I'm doing this all without like having a jack or anything. I'm assuming weapon parts is an actual item that I don't possess. All right, let's take a look. I want some... We'll take this one. It's 100 durability. We got 86. 80. And there was 70. Whoops, that's 27, it says. We'll start with these, I suppose. Let's see. Inspect vehicle. It'd be nice if it allowed me to pull from the uh, back of the vehicle. That would also be pretty cool. Oops, not what I was trying to do. Get out. I'm hitting F. Tab. Escape. F. Gotta close all the windows first, because of course, why not? Why is my it's my inventory's not full, dude. I was I was trying to pick up the tire on the floor. No! <laughs> okay, so F is normally when I go up to everything is search or interact, but here it's get in. And I understand. That's probably what you want to do when you go up to a car. But stop changing all the functionalities. Alright, well, let's go ahead and... I'm still very badly injured from the zombie biting me through the gate. Okay, this is a 27 durability. 72. 77, that's even better. Then we'll look for some lights. Got a 95. A 95. So for battery, we have a durability 1, durability 55. Okay, the battery's better. All this tire. All that. As for fuel, it has no fuel. But it's in decent shape now. Now we just need to get fuel. And I, there was that gas station down southwest. Now my character is tired because we spent the entire night sorting my warehouse of goods. Search this and hopefully there's a car alarm. No such luck. But there is a Kevlar torso suit. Pick that up for now. I may strip down so that my character is not as slow. Oh, 
put this up. Capacity 10. So when it says 10... Okay, it's 10 across, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if there's already stuff in there, which I didn't think about. Just chuck all this back on. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and strip down a bit. I want to be mobile. Plus, that'll help me to get more loot. The car is blocking me from going that way. I, I guess the way the map is generated generated the uh, highway through the building. That would explain this stuff right here. Now, obviously, I'm going to return and loot everything, but for the time being, I'm just picking what I think I might need. So we'll head over to the gas station, which is close by. That's why I picked the gas canister in there. Was expecting a little bit more more guards at that place, but I'm sure that there's going to be something at the gas station. There always is. Can't see anything. How do you spend? Okay. Jugnoth get eight damage. What's a Jugnoth? And what is hurting it? What is what is? What is so pretentious that it hit something called a Jugnoth? That's not me. I think that just hit the car. Or just bouncing off him, whatever. Come on, game. You know, I'm not an archer, but I don't think that's how crossbow boats work when you hit zombies. I mean, is he armored? I guess so. I don't know. I'm sure that his armor is better than my armor. Side on a direction, dude. Let's try hitting you in the leg. Okay, it still bounces off just whenever it feels like. Started my diary today. I guess that's a juggernaut. I think he sees me. I think it's stupid that like, I'm, I'm just going to end up walking to a zombie like this.
Wow. Okay. Remove the battery. And do you have any fuel? No. Search. 5% speed. Mine is better. Let's disassemble you. Drink this. Ten percent speed. Ten percent defense. All right, let's search these uh, next to the front gate, which is still up. Good. Cool. Wow. All right. So how do? I guess we're full now. I'm not gonna search the others for the. Am I leak? Is it leaking or something? What was that sound? We're not gonna search the others for now. So I'm gonna try to remember that's the bottom left one. So I don't know. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna grab that right now. Whatever happens, I'm not leaving that behind. I haven't actually looked at the specs of that, but we're, I mean, obviously taking it. My biggest problem with the deer is that it lures zombies to me. Alright, so my, the car that I was assembling was just straight up up here, pretty much. Ah! You're gonna make me play inventory Tetris, you could at least keep this green still. our stuff into the truck. Okay, I closed these doors last time I was here. Apparently they just phase out of existence. Alright. Let's go and inspect the vehicle. Add fuel. search and just chuck everything in the back. Probably don't need all this stuff here. Also some of the worst tires. Now it says the battery remaining well can I Even though the battery itself is bad, there still says there's 1,200 units inside. I like that it just sort of move, uh, changes as a graphic when I'm dragging it around. If you can see here, it looks like an actual headlight now. And when I let go of it, it turns into a light bulb. Okay, and now we're just going to chuck everything into the back of this vehicle that we're not using to actively try to fight. Apparently I don't have a lot of arrows left. I know I shot six in this direction, but... Now the question is, do I know how to drive that vehicle out of here?
Okay, A is turn the car left. Oh, it actually does it right. So a lot of games, it, it, it really confuses me a little bit because if you're holding down, say, left, and then trying to reverse, the game doesn't actually understand how to do that, and it just makes you... It, it doesn't do it in real car mechanics-wise, uh, so to say. Okay, so, yeah, I actually kind of like the way this car looks as it's moving. I don't know how it handles. We did leave a bunch of deer meat on the side, and we can't actually get through this way at all because of the of, of that. I, I, I knew that there was a building at the other end. I just kind of figured that there would be a hole in the highway at all. Is that a, is that a gap? That might be a gap. Okay, apparently I have to chop down the tree first. 